For years, the state's Children, Youth and Families Department has come under fire for failing to protect the most vulnerable New Mexicans. Now, some lawmakers are pushing a controversial idea to improve CYFD's performance. Here's News 13's Marilyn Upchurch. The proposed bill is supported by CYFD. It would limit police officers' power in CYFD custody situations. When there is trouble in a home and a child is in danger, it is often a police officer who makes the decision to take a child out of that home. But some experts who work with foster kids say that's a mistake. Really, as you can imagine, creates a lot of trauma. Ezra Spitzer with NMCAN, a nonprofit that works with foster children, helped write Senate Bill 128. He thinks trained professionals should be showing up to scenes, not cops. Police generally have a law enforcement background and they're, they're not trained to assess those situations. They're the ones who will take custody. They, that custody goes to our feet. The bill would take away authority police have when they show up to a situation. They would rely on CYFD to determine when a child needs to be taken into custody. The head of the Albuquerque Police Union disagrees. This um, is not even a band-aid. I think it exacerbates the problem. CYFD doesn't have the resources or the infrastructure to be dispatched to calls like this. The police union says they have specialty units trained for these situations. Uh, right now, if an officer uh, gets dispatched to a case where the officer feels that the child is in danger, they do what's called a 48-hour hold, and they, they will take physical custody of the child right there on the scene, and they'll immediately call CYFD. But Senator Correa Hempel says police should be a last resort. Of course, there's going to be times when uh, police are absolutely necessary. They're a critical part of our society, and um, there are times when that's going to be the safest response. Right now, this bill has been tabled. Senator Correa Hampill is also proposing a task force made up of CYFD workers, social workers, and police officers to come up with ideas on how to better protect children in our state. Back to you. Marilyn, thank you. The Albuquerque Police Union says its officers respond to child abuse calls as many as 25 times a day.